Um, so recently I watched this movie called Sarah Burgess is a Loser. It's an amazing, it's an adorable movie. It's about this girl who is plus-sized, as I am myself. Anyways, she ta- she meets this guy, but, like, on accident. This pop, she, this popular girl gives this one guy her number, Sarah Burgess number, and they start talking. But he thinks that it's the pretty girl that she's talking to. And they talk, but she doesn't tell them who she really is. It's a really good movie. It's on Netflix, and I recommend you watch it. But the at the end, spoiler alert, she writes a song. And, I don't know, something about the song, it really resonated with me. Um, It's about this girl. And she... She, it's about a sunflower. Here, I'll just play it. Rose girls in glass faces, perfect bodies, perfect faces. They all belong in magazines. Those girls the boys are chasing, winning all the games they're playing, they're in a friend's league, stretching toward the sky like I don't care, wishing you could see me standing there. But I'm a sunflower, a little funny If I were a rose, maybe you'd want me If I could, I'd change overnight I'd turn into something you like But I'm a sunflower, a little funny If I were a rose, maybe you'd pick me But I know you don't have a clue The sunflower's waiting for you Waiting for you But I'm a sunflower A little funny And if I were her Maybe you'd pick me But I know you don't have a clue The sunflower's waiting for you Waiting for you That song is so beautiful. I just love it so much. And now I'm going to obsess over it for a couple of weeks from now on. But I mostly started this live stream to talk about something that I've been kind of stalling about. My own body. Um, I began my eating disorder when I was eight years old, when my parents got divorced, and I didn't have any really good friends then, so I ate to, you know, consume the pain that I had over my parents' divorce. Um, I need to find my glasses. Um, I don't overeat anymore, and it's not like I exercise all the time. It's not like I don't exercise, like, I don't, like, force myself to go exercise, but, like, I'll walk around and stuff, but, it, it's just kind of hard to lose the weight. It just, this kind of happens. But that's when my eating disorder started. And I have had, like, crushing, like, really heavy mental crushing blows to myself about how I look. And I'm still not even close to being happy with my body. And I don't think I'll ever be happy in my own skin. But this song, it just, it, it's so beautiful and it, it means and it understands exactly what I always think it it's just it makes sense to me like not many other things do um I know someday that I want 
I'm I and probably and hopefully soon. I'm gonna try so hard to get make my body so I'm happy with it. But I don't think right now I'd even go out in a one piece swimsuit because I look at myself in the mirror sometimes and I'm just disgusted with myself. It's it it sucks a lot, but maybe someday soon I myself will be happy with my own body. But it's also hard enough since I'm in tenth grade and like tenth grade's hard enough as it is. Everybody's but especially at my school, everybody has big fancy houses and nice designer clothes and their own sports teams and they're athletic and like super fit and skinny. And I come from a small house, a poor family, and I'm bigger than everybody else there. I like to try and stay positive most of the time, but sometimes there's just times when you can't handle it and you just don't want to move because you don't think you deserve to look this way, but you do. I don't really know what else to say, but I just kind of felt like talking and getting that off my chest. And showing that song with you. I, I recommend you watch Sarah, Sarah Burgess. This is, is a loser. It's it's a really good movie. She it's a really good about a lot about good body positivity. Especially recently. Um since like all of my friends I started dating and I just feel like I'm stuck in this rut because I I don't think I'm a bad person. I feel like I have a good personality, but that just might be me and I'm actually a bitch, I don't know. Mm, but all the pretty girls get the guys. And I'm just gonna stop here. But I guess that's how it's gonna happen. I'm, and I have no one else to blame but myself. Maybe, hopefully, someday soon I'll be able to be happy in my own skin. Alright. Thanks for listening. I'll see you next time. Or not. <laughs>